to Counter Diary. Counter Diary, we're telling you the untold stories of Liberia. My name is Emmanuel Kotu, and uh, you know, uh, this is the only uh, show that tells you exactly what is happening in our country in terms of development and happenings within our country. So today, I'm in Johnsonville, and to be precise, I'm at the Jesse Lodge and our Jesse Bar, Jesse Resort. Everything you think about is at Jesse, you know, Airbnb. Everything you want is right here. So I'm going to be speaking to the, you know, the owner of the area and you're going to be explaining to me the last time i was here so what are some of those improvements that have been made already at this area if you're coming for the first time please if you're watching it on youtube make sure you hit that subscription button subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos on liberia it's summertime let's enjoy liberia together so i just uh, uh met the you know the ceo again uh the last time we we're here uh, welcome to the county diary thank you mr Cotter. it's a pleasure and welcome back to jesse's lunch facility all right so let's talk about uh jesse lunch some are asking uh liberian oh yeah. Yeah, it's a liberian owned business. Okay, um, but people are asking, you know, some people say that, ah, where are the men coming from? Uh, have you been out of the country? Well, um, I live in the U.S. Um, mm -hmm. as a businessman, uh, the CEO of Peter Masico Insurance Agency, LLC, uh, based in New Jersey, licensed in 17 states. Uh, like I told you before, we thought it was coming to Liberia back in 2021 to help take back our economy. I say take back our economy because in the past we have all Lebanese and all our nationals venturing into the entertainment industry, the culture and tourism. And few other Liberians decided to join the fray by investing. This is why we started in 2021 with Jesse's Bar in Nizo. And then we acquired this property, um, I mean, this land and then developed it. It's an acre. So over here is a multi purpose entertainment complex where we have an indoor playground for children. We have a net club, we have event hall, uh, large other swimming pool, kids swimming pool, restaurant, other game rooms, and then the newly constructed guest house uh, that I will also be taking you to as well. All right, uh, so we're here at the Jesse Lock. Now, there's one thing uh, before, while we're going around, I see uh, so many things. I see what is here today. So uh, this is one of the newest additions. Hmm. When you came here before, we only had like a little shell, but now this is a full flesh boutique where you come in and purchase your swimwear. You can come here because some people come into the facility, they just come in to maybe eat or have that little drink and have conversation. They don't know that it's a swimming pool in here, but when they see the water, they get tempted. Oh, I want to swim. You don't have to go to your house. Just come right here. You get a shorts for an affordable price. You can, for the female, they can have that swimming suit. We also have other promotional items for Jesse Lodge, which has to do with the cap. We just set a cap for five dollars. We have your backpack that you could use for shopping, or the kids could use for school. We have our T-shirts. We have sweater. This is a way of supporting the business as well. And uh, this other side, what is it? This is the photo booth. Okay. You come here, you can take a pictures. It's up right now, Jesse's Lodge that you can post on your social media page. Um, we have the hammer. We just talk it out because we only put it there when we're very busy, or as the children keep. Riding with it as well. All right, so while we're going in there, that's something. Uh, let's talk about this. Uh, if I'm going to come here, how much do I pay to enter? Well, um, we have a reduced price because mm -hmm. we, we know that the economy is not really okay. So from Monday to Thursday, it's $200 to enter this facility. 200 LD? 200 LD. Okay. It doesn't include swimming. You pay your 200 to enter, you get free pictures, unlimited pictures, you get access to free internet. You listen to good music and then all of your food and drinks. If you want to swim, you just pay your five dollars at the gate and you have access to the pool. The thing with the children. Okay, uh, the last time I came, this place was like a little bit different. What do we have here now? 
so we have a more improved uh indoor playground for the kids we just brought in new equipment for them we have like the the, the trampoline we have the bounce house we have the swing we have a uh, inflammable pool because this is the official pool for the kids mm. and i watched about it. we noticed that two years old cannot go in here because of the depth of the pool okay so we decided to bring inflammable pool that it will also be able to use and have fun as well okay so this is the pool for the kids and uh, i like uh, the playground the last time we came i was just trying to dump you know but i think there's some improvement here let's go in there and see So, um, so this is the this is the the indoor playground at Jesse's Lodge. So we have the swing. This was in here. We just brought it. Uh, so all of these equipment we focus on children between uh, two years old to seven years old because we have to look at the weight, the size. With this one, this is the bounce house. We don't, I mean the trampoline. We take up to twelve years old. You can get about 10 person in there at once. We have the mini basketball hub where they play the basketball. This is the mini pool I told you about the toddler for two to three years old. They can use this. And then this is another bounce house for the children. We have the hostelry over there. And then uh, there are two bounce houses we have here for them. Um, the other one is being put together right now, as you can see over there. And then we have another swing over here for the children as well. Mm -hmm. So this is being put together already? Yeah. So we have to use the air to blow it up and we can have this another swing for them. So we, we encouraging children, I mean all the adults to bring their children because we realize that most entertainment places doesn't have a specific place for children. At Jesse Law, we don't mix kids with adults because you have to be 18 and above before you drink alcohol. So seeing the kids watching you drink, of course, when you're not around, they want to try. So this is what we build this specifically for them. Uh, some of them will put the chairs out outside, all of the ice cream, the popcorn, the fries with chicken, while they have fun on the side. And we have a caretaker that monitor them as well. All right, so uh, we done with these, uh, the children playground. Where are we heading to next? So we're heading to, uh, we're going around the pool and then I'll take you to our indoor VIP where you use it for multi-purpose functions. Okay, so uh, I'm taking you around Jesse Lodge now. We're going up to the deck, and then the, we're going to have a view of the other pool and also our large outdoor eco friendly restaurant and bar. All right, so guys, uh, I like the fact that this place is very spacious enough. All the other area you go, uh, it's a bit tight, you know, but yeah, you got free space. Yeah. Uh, what inspired it? Well, um, like I mentioned, it's multi purpose. So we couldn't put it in an area that is so tight. We understood that we have more people coming into this facility, so we decided to make it very big. So this is the deck. So at the time people come to the pool, they just want to sit out of that pool and drink and watch people swim in the pool. Mm. This is why this deck was constructed. You cannot come from the water and sit here. We have special area for people who are using the pool to sit because they are wet. So this is the eco friendly deck. We also have the cabana. Um, that I'm going to show you that people who want extra privacy with their family or special guests, they could just book one in the cabana and just sit in there and have a good time. So as you can see, the water is very refreshing. Our filter on, now the water is in, is in a circulation. Keep the water very fresh because we don't, you know, the water, as the water gets stale, it smells. So we have a filter system, it's a 75,000 gallon capacity filter yeah. that we put on ahead to keep the water in circulation. So you can come here from Monday to Sunday, any hour in the day up to 11 p.m. Our water is very fresh and ready for you. As you can see, it's very clean and sparkling. Very clean and sparkling. Uh, I always start loving the place. Uh, the only thing uh, I need to start getting my swimming lesson. <laughs> so I have time to, 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 to swim at this time now. Yeah, so this, this is another center part of the deck. Uh, these are the cabana. We have about five cabana. Each cabana take up to 15 persons. So if you have to, if you want to celebrate your birthday party, you could book one. If you come into Jesse Lowe with your family and you don't want to struggle for seats, especially on the weekends, you could just put in for one of the cabana and then you and your family have easy access to it. So uh, to book how much is that going to cost me? So it's $50 for the cabana. I mean, like I said, it takes up to 15 persons. It comes with one seat shot. 
All right, so um, this way is just the normal bar. Yeah, there's a regular bar. Also, the, the restaurant, people sit there, order the food, you eat, also watch people in the pool. Again, because of the pressure of the seat, we don't allow people using the pool to come over here because you wet, it's a sponge, and it gets messed up for other people that wearing dry clothes. So we just leave it like that. People can sit all around the pool. We also have chairs over there. We also have another corner over there where people... All right, so um, we see all of these and... Um... I understand you got uh, some improvement uh, at the club. So can we walk to the club? Yeah, definitely. See. So uh, we're walking up to the club to show you um, this place. They have, I don't know, I want to say like four different uh, uh, areas uh, talking about the pool, you got a restaurant, and then you got a club, and then you also have a lodge for you know for your relaxation. So let's walk, let's walk, let's walk through the side. And then uh, we moving up. Like, what, what are those things I mean added to the to the to the club? So um, we added the live dance feature. Mm. We increased the sound system, and we also have a Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi. Yeah. So, so what I mean, it, I can read that. <laughs> yeah. It's for free. Yeah, free. Oh, free. Wow. Once you enter Jesse Love Facility Internet. So welcome. Um, this is the the VIP section. Mm. So we use them for multi-purpose. People want to have workshop, people want to have private meetings, people want to have conferences, people want to have private parties. This is the perfect venue for that. We have a projector that you can use for your event. So in case you don't have one, on the weekends we have live entertainment in this place. We have our band, our own equipment. That is, I mean, that you'll be entertained with live music. We have its own bathroom, two, four bathrooms, two for males and two for females, all running waters. Um, we also have private booths in here. Okay. Private booths. So, I mean, when you talk about private booths, um... What, what make it private because so this year, right? It's, it's private because mm. once you make a reservation mm. for that, only you and your team will be in that particular booth. Over here, which is a general area, anybody can sit anywhere. But this private booth, not just anybody, it's reserved. So if we're having our live entertainment, if you want you and your guests to come, you have to reserve it. We have two different sections for that, for that purpose. And this room is fully air conditioned. So you don't have to worry about the heat. It's for the air condition as well. So um, the, for reservation purposes, um, how much does it cost? So you have to deposit $50. For you the hope to have assets. You deposit $50 mm -hmm. and you're going to drink and eat within the same $50. So you don't just pay in $50. This, this hall takes up to 150 people. So people who want to even have that wedding reception and have smaller guests. We take up to 200 because we have the Porsche. The Porsche is part of the VIP club. That takes up to 40 people. And then we have two separate cabanas to the back. A lot of people come to wedding reception, not everybody in the building. A lot of people outside eating, especially during reception, we can easily fit another 30 person, 15, 15 each of the cabanas. All right, so we've seen all of these areas that uh, the knee improvement out of here. What are the contact information? Are you on Facebook or WhatsApp? So you can follow Jesse's Lodge on Google. Mm -hmm. Just Google Jesse's Lodge Liberia. We will come up. You can follow us on Facebook, Jesse's Lodge. Uh, you can also follow on, on Instagram, Jesse's Lodge. Um, for contact information, you can call directly on 077-816-6796. That number is also on WhatsApp. All right, so that number is on WhatsApp. We've done with this place. We're now going to the Jesse Lodge. Some of you say, I want a place to stay, right? So we're done with this part. Let's go and show you how that area look. look. Keep watching the counter diary. So we have the children. So the adults can be in one room and the children be in another room. So that's what I was also built for. All right, so you heard that uh, maybe you want to have a short stay in Liberia, almost like Airbnb, it's available as well, at the Jesse Lodge in uh, Johnsonville. So we're going here to now show you exactly how in here look. I know you've heard uh, uh, Mr. Masakwe talking about, you know, uh, what they have here, but we're going in there. So where, where, where are we entering? So this is the main entrance to Jesse's guest house, okay. where you'll be received by our professional receptionist that will be able to maybe show you our menu, the prices for viewer rooms, and then you can be ushered in. All right, so let's get in. 
So, uh, welcome to Jesse's guest house. This is the reception area. We have a mini bar right here that our customer gets checked in. So we put the bar for a reason. Sometimes people want to get cold water, they want to have a cold beer or a wine, and stuff going down to the lodge. We make everything easy, like a one-stop shop. So we have a perfect relaxation area. You can wait here to have a conversation. Let's say, for example, you're spending the night, weekend, or whatever, or even short stay, but you want to have a meeting with a guest before proceeding to your room, you can also be here. Or if you stay in here for a while now, or for a long time vacation, and you have family member coming over to you, instead of coming directly to your room, you can receive them right here. You also have its own bathroom. Uh, this is the bathroom for the guest. Um, everywhere has running water, kind of cold running water. So while your guest waiting, you can also use the last. All right, I'll see you on the other side. Is it same for the other side? No, that, that's a storage for the bar. Okay, the so I like this place. I'll tell you guys, uh, you know, you enter. Um, I mean, nobody's going to disturb in your room. You got a place to relax outside. So let's check out the rooms, uh, sure. how it looks like. So we are... So like I was telling you earlier on, mm -hmm. this is the main lobby. This is where we have our VIP rooms. So we have 22 rooms. And all of our rooms are named after the counties. We know that we have 15 counties <laughs> of Liberia. So I'm going to show you the first two uh, bigger counties, with, uh, which is uh, Nima County. And Lofa. Okay, before we enter there, let me ask you, what brought about the naming of, uh, you know, uh, the rooms after the counties? Well, we don't want to make it traditional. Mm -hmm. uh, Liberia is our country. Uh, if you want to just use Batonese, so we have uh, several rooms and we name it after states. You, get, you go to New York, you go to Minnesota. But this is Liberia. We try to put our, let's say, promote our own culture. I'm from Lover County, so I feel comfortable sleeping in Lover County right here in Jonesville. <laughs> <laughs> so, so it's time for Liberia. All right, it's time for Liberia. Let's get yeah. to, we're going to Lofa first, okay? Let's get to Lofa County. This, this is Lofa County. Lofa has a very beautiful king size bed. Um, they have a little refrigerator. They have the TV, uh, that smart TV. We have Netflix, everything for our guests to entertain them. Um, we have the, 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 the bathroom. Um, the, the, the standing classes are all coming right now. Uh, yeah, this is a this is a mini class. This is just temporary because we procure a standardized closet that people can store their clothes, store their shoes, and everything. It will be in the country hopefully for the next week. Uh, so this is the this is the bathroom right here. All right. So this bathroom uh, does it come with like cool or hot water? Yeah, hot and cool water. You see the running water system right here. They come over. Everything flush very well. <laughs> Kind of water in here. All right, I'm from Lofa and I'm happy that maybe one of, one of these days I will come and sleep in Lofa. Let's get to the next area, Nima County. So this is Nima. Yeah, you're called Nima, yes. Yeah, Nima right here. <laughs> this is Nima County. Okay. Nima also is a beautiful place. Uh, you have a standard king size bed. People watching may want to know, yeah. it just costs you 65 bucks. Wow. $65 to sleep on one of these beds. This is a king size bed, fully air conditioned. It comes with a pool access. Uh, you don't have to go to the lodge. You have your own VIP swimming pool right here. You have free breakfast. You have access to the internet, all in the $65. And I always told my people, if you're coming from abroad, or if you live in Liberia or want to have like a longer stay, mm -hmm. a three nights, or maybe a week-long vacation, we also give you what we call flat rate. So you're not going to pay 65 per night. We're going to give you flat rate. You so, so when you say when you say the flat rate, uh, how much are we talking about? Because most of my viewers, uh, this is what they're concerned about. Like yeah. uh, they're saying, okay, I have my project in Johnsonville, yeah. and every time I have to stay in uh, maybe Seiko or maybe Tinker Village somewhere around there, yeah. I just want a place to stay around Johnsonville. Um, when you're saying like um, flat rate. For those who are staying for, let's say, more than one week, how much are you talking so about? So if you're spending, uh, let's say, a week here, mm -hmm. I just tell you, maybe you're going to save extra $10 per night. So you just mm -hmm. give me 50 times 7. So listen, I'm like Airbnb, everything is here, $50 per night. All right, let's move away from Nimba County. Where are we going next? So we're going to another county. Um, uh. We have Bone County. Central Liberia. This is Bone County. A very beautiful bed. The same thing, same size of room, same bathroom, same amenities. And then this is Magibi. This is Magibi. 
Maggie Bikane right here. Very beautiful setup. All of these rooms have hot and cold running water. We have about 290 feet borehole system. Our water doesn't itch your skin. It's natural. It's very refreshing. We're not getting water from the container. Well, we're, we're taking it from the creek. No, we have our own borehole system. All right, so uh, we dealt with the, uh, I mean, I don't, we can't go in all of the counties. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm sure you have two different sizes here. Yeah, so this is one of the uh, regular rooms. Okay. This is the queen size bed. This is Grand Gita County. So the queen size bed, this is $50 per night. The difference is mm. the king size bed is a little bit smaller than the, I mean, the queen size bed is a little bit smaller than the king size bed where you pay 65 per night. This is 50 per net. We apply the same discount. If you come in for longer stay, one week and above, we still give you flat rate. The same benefit that comes with the king size bed, which include internet facility, hot and cold water, free breakfast and access to the pool. You have the same thing here. Only the bed size different. Okay, let's check the bathroom for this sure. place. This is the bathroom. Wow. We see hot and cold running water, everything. This is cute, the queen size and the king size mm -hmm. uh, rooms that you have of the Jesse Lodge in Johnsonville. This is Grand Cook County. You see king, uh, queen size bed and stuff. Oh, oh. the Mokapi. Mo yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have everything for the air condition, the same thing. Oh, wow. Yeah. All right, so um, I think uh, I like the, the fact that you have that beautiful design. Yeah. Was, it, was it done by a Liberian? Because I want to appraise yeah, a Liberian. Yeah. So before we go to the design, I want to show you this. This is River G. So a lot of people talk about we are we are very budget friendly. Okay. This is the same queen size bed, but it comes with the fan. With this, you pay forty dollars per night to sleep in here. Okay. If you just want to stay for an hour, it's five dollars. For the king size bed with air condition, one hour is ten dollars. For the king size bed, the big one, is fifteen dollars per hour. If you spend two hours or more, we we'll also give you discount as well. So now you heard, right? You guys just stay. So uh, fifteen dollars, ten dollars, five dollars. Wow, this is great. These are all the five dollar rooms, the forty dollars per night. See, Maryland County, we have Kakata. Right. Yeah. yeah, Kakata is right there. And then, so this hour was done by Sammy. He's a Liberian graphic artist, very professional. He did all of the drawings at, at our facility. If you came into Jesse Lodge or before entering with Jesse Lodge, you can see a lot of beautiful artwork on the fence. He did all just that. He also did this. So we talk about portraying Liberian culture. It's similar to the Atlantic Ocean, the many islands. Maybe in the future we're going to construct one of these in one of the counties. So we just for the to keep looking at that to see. All right, so we've seen all of these, and I like the hallway here. You see how yeah. beautiful it looks. So, so this is a short stay area. Uh, is, is this is this where you talk about when you're talking about uh, maybe the two rooms, or we'll go to no, the, the two rooms separate. So this is just a short stay area. So we try to separate people who want to spend like an hour or two from people who actually spending longer time here. So we're going to put a glass door right there to separate. So this is the main entrance. If you want to come to the reception, it's good and pay for your one hour. We're going to use all of the facilities here. All right, so we're done with the, you know, this side. We're now going to what I call the real Airbnb. In the, you know, you have like two different uh, rooms that you could, maybe you come with a family to Liberia and you say, I want a place where my children will also stay. We are going to that side of the So keep watching. This is the Counter Diary. We're telling you the untold stories of Liberia and Liberians are actually coming back home to build this country. Keep watching. All right, so we're about to go to the side of the two room, but before that, uh, there is something here for the VIP. Yes, yeah, uh, so this is the pool. Earlier on, I talked about the, the, the guest house pool. This pool will be open on the 29th of November. Uh, so um, it's right here. As you can see, we, we are working very hard to make sure that it's ready for Friday. Uh, this is the pool right here. Uh, we have its own bathroom. This is six feet deep. But we're going to do it in a way where the water will not reach to the top because in Liberia, you don't find a lot of tall people. So we're going to keep the water at more at five feet. Um, it's also been fed from with water from our borehole system right behind you. You have your own bathroom. You, you don't have to be bothered to go to the guest house if you want to ease yourself. You have a washing room 
Of course, you have to rinse the skin before you get into the pool and afterwards. We also have a dressing room. So even if you come here in a cold suit, just to have fun, and you change your mind that you want to swim, we have our mini store right in Jesse's Lodge where you could get your swimming shorts and you come and have fun into the swimming pool. All right, so the guys said they will reduce, they will not put all the water because some of us are not that tall. <laughs> Again, we are heading to our self-contained rooms where we talk about like an Airbnb style. It could be used for a bachelor night. They have two rooms, you could use one for male, another for female. If you want to have a weekend getaway with your children, the adult can be in one room and the kids be in another room that you can be able to monitor. So they'll go ahead. All right, so we're going here for you and your kids, or probably you want to bring a brother party. So this is a this is a Montserrado, the capital. I mean the the uh, the Montserrado County, and we have to have Monrovia right here. So so we can go in, in Monrovia. Beautifully laid out. We're setting it up already. Uh, Matches everything in. So the difference between these rooms are the the, the size of the bathroom. If you notice, all of the other rooms we're in, we have the, the standing closet that we put it in. But this one has an inbuilt closet because why? It was constructed in a way more like a residential style where you spend a longer stay. So we want it, we want it to be comfortable. You're going to have your own flat screen TV, air condition, everything coming up, and you're still doing the installation. So here's the bathroom. So have a big closet right here for it. Um, the bathroom, everything has the same running water system. Running water, everything had in cold water as well. Okay. So uh, then uh, another room on the other side. Yeah, so this is Montserrat right here. So same thing. Air condition being installed, bed being set up. So I can assure you by Friday, you come here, everything is ready for you. All right, so the mic is me. I know. So we just show you. Okay, guys. So um, this place, if I want to, let's say, uh, come and spend the night there. How much does this place cost? So it's the same. Uh, we charge sixty dollars per night. Sixty for the both room. No. So if you want, if you want the both room per night, we're gonna charge you ninety dollars, meaning that you get the both. We give you the discount for that. So you'll be saving that extra thirty bucks. Okay, guys, so thank you so much for watching this edition of the program, The Counter Diary. We are at the Jesse Lodge here in Johnsonville. Uh, uh, this is Mozzarella County. I know most of you are in my inbox. Uh, man, show us good place. We want to stay. We want to stay. I don't want to go far away from Johnsonville. The best place can be is at the Jesse Lodge here. So if you enjoy watching this video, please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And those of you watching on KMTV, thank you so much on the sitcom or on Boss TV. Thanks for watching. My name is Emmanuel Kotu. Keep watching. Bye bye from my end. So